A kite is another quadrilateral. Let's go through its attributes. It has one pair of opposite angles that are congruent. It has two disjoint pairs of consecutive congruent sides. Disjoint, you may realize that you've got a prefix here, dis meaning not, joint meaning together. The root word joint is, is together. So you have not together, two not together pairs of consecutive congruent sides. All right, so we have two, two sides that you can't use any of the elements in one for the other. So here's a pair and here's a pair, but this one could not be used here because it's a disjoint pair. Once you've claimed it as a pair, that's it. The other pair of disjoint congruent sides are these two. Congruent means they are the same measure. That's why I use different hash marks for those pairs. The diagonals are perpendicular. Well, a diagonal goes from opposite vertices. So here's one of them, and here's the other. They're perpendicular. This vocabulary word means forms right angles. It crosses two lines or two line segments that cross forming right angles. So here we've got some 90 degree angles right in the middle of this kite on each of the I'm sides. I'm going to call this one the major diagonal because it's longer. So the major diagonal bisects the minor diagonal. Well, bisect is a term that means it crosses or cuts another line or segment and makes it it makes the pieces equal. The major diagonal bisects, remember when something bisects, it cuts forming two equal parts. Bisects a pair of opposite angles. Well, here's the major diagonal. So it's cutting this pair of angles is going to be congruent to the other side and also it bisects this one. So this one right here, those are congruent.